Okay, so what I'm doing is I'm taking a video which is an MP4 and I'm converting it in Handbrake. And it's going to come out of it as an M4V. I'm using the Apple TV3 to do the conversion. And uh, let's see how it works. I'm going to uh, drop it into iTunes as soon as it's finished and let's see what happens. And the reason I'm doing this now is for uh, 3 Rimlav, who is asking the question there. He says he's converted everything with Handbrake, but when I try to put the file into iTunes, nothing happens. What should I try next? Well, I think it's probably going into iTunes. It's probably just a case that you can't find it once it's in there. So let's just uh, do this and follow it through and just see um, how I do it and see how we can uh, suggest some things to you to get your movies into iTunes. Come on, come on, hurry up Harry, come on. We're nearly there, getting towards the end now. 98% done, come on, come on, hurry up Harry, come on. Yay, we're nearly there, 99.999% and it's done. Okay, so now we can drag it and drop it and copy it into iTunes. Let's go into my folder, see where it is. There's the one I wanted to put into iTunes. Okay, so here we are in iTunes, and I'm just going to put it down next to the Finder window here. So here's a Finder window, and there's the file that we want to put in there. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to take this, drag it, and drop it over here. And this is the place where you have to drop it up in this uh, top left-hand corner here. So I've dropped it there, and it says it's copied it. So now let's have a look and see where it is. So uh, we could look in films and it's called geotagging. So let's just look for it now. Geotagging your photos in iPhoto. There it is. Well, that went in, no problem at all. I would suggest that maybe what you want to try doing is um, turning off iTunes and turn it back on again. Sometimes that works. I've had a success with that. Have a look in iTunes. Let's see, that's, that's a good way of doing this, okay. Somewhere, wherever, in in your um, finder window, do a search. Okay, so we're going to start with um, geotagging. Okay, so file name matches geotagging. There's the files that have just come up there, look. And this is a way to find out where they actually are. I'm going to click on that first one. Now that one is in movies. So that's where I've just dragged it from in the finder. And when it goes into iTunes, it actually makes a copy. So um, this next one down here... And see, there it goes. Music, iTunes, iTunes Media, Home Videos. Now it's gone there as a home video. I don't really want it as a home video. So maybe that's why you can't find it in your iTunes. Because it's gone there a home video and you're looking someplace where you don't find the home videos. Let's go into films there. So if I look through films, I'm not going to find it in there because it's in home videos, isn't it? Let's click on home videos. Let's go to get info. And I'm going to change this in options. And change it from home video to wherever one I put it. So this could be a podcast and I'll know where to find it. It'd be in the podcast or a music video or film. Let's put it in with the other films and then I'll know exactly where to find it. So let's have a look at info first of all. So there's the info there. And just to make sure we're going to find it, let's look for album. Okay, so I put Mac20Q in for the artist, Mac20Q for the album. And I'm going to click on OK. And it's gone from the home videos now, and it is going to be in films. Let's go to films. And there it is there, look. And look, it's even got the new tag on there as well, look. How about that then? So, that is what I suggest you do. Do some searching, and I think you'll probably find it. And have a look in the home videos, because if you're looking in films, then you ain't going to find it there, because it'll be someplace else. So, uh, let me know how you get on. I'm looking forward to hearing some good news from you in a very, very near future. Bye-bye now, this is Dave Allen. Thanks for watching the video, and why don't you check out the other videos? Here's two of them. There's one video there, and one video there that you can click on and go and have a look at now. And don't forget that you can also subscribe. Talk to you again soon. Bye-bye now.